Hey bosses, it's Nina. So I found a cool little tool um, searching on Instagram that helps you create multiple links for your Instagram link. <laughs> I'm going to say that again and actually in a different way. That's not really what the tool is made for, but in Instagram, you can only have one link. And I know a lot of people use a couple of different methods to share multiple links. I just didn't like the tools that were out there too much. So I did see elink.io and I thought it was an awesome link when I looked at what they can do. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. This is my first look as far as signing up. I did look at someone else's and I love the way they were using it. It was a natural hair person. So um, I'm going to go ahead and look at unlimited e-links, basic templates, and ad banner. That's fine for me. I'm going to go ahead and use that one. The way this person was using it was basically it was a visual representation of all of their social media links. And from what I kind of looked at with videos and things like this, this um, solution allows you to create your newsletters and send them out and create um, di different visual curated content um, to share with people. So I'm going to kind of hack it a little bit and use it the way um, I saw it online. Okay, so I'm just going to get started. I obviously ignored everything that they just told me as I was talking to you. So it looks like there's different formats here, which I love. And think of this, th one of the things that they said they can do is use it as a newsletter, which I think is awesome. Um, I'm going to use it for my social media links. I'm just kind of see which one I want to use. I think I do want a short description and something at the top. It's going to be viewed mostly from my iPhone, or excuse me, mostly from people's phones. So I want to make sure it actually looks Right, so I think I'm going to use this one for now. Oh, of course, I picked the one that needs to be upgraded. It says Pro, biggest day. So let me use Amaya. How cute. I know someone named Amaya. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and paste my URL links. Let me just change the view here. And here's my Pink Boss Club. Wasn't planned, but I happen to have it ready. Okay. Oh, cool. You could upload your own image. So let me pause this as I find the image that I want to use for this. Okay. So this is the image I want to use for this. Let me just put this back on full screen. Um, enter tags. So I guess this is Facebook. I don't know what the tags are used for yet. Value community solutions, just because that's what I do. Um, and let's say small business. Actually, let's remove these. Small business. Um, and let's just say social media. Workflows. Automation. Right? Okay. And let's delete this and see what it says. Title. Pink Boss Club. Let's do Facebook community. And I'm going to copy and paste what I have about the Pink Boss Club here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and save this. And you'll see that it's already starting on the right hand side. Other thing I want to put on there and actually what I want to put first is going to be my YouTube. Okay, and I'll probably upload a separate picture for this. And what I'll do is I'll come back after I include all my links and start editing everything. Hi, Princess. Okay, I've actually added about five different links, which is totally against my rule of thought when it comes to marketing. If you give people too many things, then they're going to go to, they're going to get overwhelmed and not click on anything. But I do want to try this out. So I'm going to go to next. Um, one thing that I do need to do is add the header. Oh, good. Next thing is to add a header. So there's the pro one. I'm going to go down to, ooh, I like text overlay. But let's do plain. 
Um, oh no, actually, let's do text overlay because that's where you get your image. Um, let's see what images I have on my desktop. And I don't know if this is going to fit because it didn't fit with, oh, it might. It didn't fit with um, these actual individual items, but it might fit for this. Um, I think, can I drag it? Yep. I like it. Yes. Okay, good. So we're going to keep it there. I'm going to say entrepreneurial marketing influencer business consultant socially. Nina. Notice, oh, okay, I can't do all of that. So, um, I want marketing influencer more. Nina Thomas. Um, I try to switch them up as far as my keywords and what I call myself different places because you never know what people are searching for. I know I'm ranking number three for this or number two or three for this. Um, so I want to keep um, that going. Okay. And this I'm just going to pull from my site. So let me pause one more time. Alrighty, so I copied and pasted my little quick description. I actually like this. And so let's go to the top. Yes. Okay. I may not want to put the socially Nina behind it because this looks a little bit messy. Or I may not want to put the actual text here. So maybe if I take off my text, I'm wondering if it changes the spacing. I think I'm just going to leave it like that for now. I don't really have time to really mess around with this right now. Um, I'm supposed to be working on a blog. So I'm going to click on next. I probably should put in the head, uh, the header because text because of SEO. But for now, this is fine. Do you want to add a profile to your e-link? I don't know what that means. So let's go ahead and select yes. Oh, web links. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and change, in, change a couple of these things and then come back and show you the results. You know how to copy and paste and put everything in. So let's figure out what I'm going to put here. Okay, just a quick note. It did have me go back to the header and add the title. So I did change the picture. Um, I'll come back and figure out what I want to do with that. Um, my links and all of that are up at the top that I just created. So I do want to change the image. I'll do that in just a second. I just want to go ahead and click on save and show you what comes next. So I'm going to give my e-link a name. So let's call this Instagram or let's say Insta leads. No. Okay. And of course I like brand colors. Oh, they got me with that one. You have to um, upgrade to get your own brand colors. So, um, I don't want to choose, oh, all of the colors. Okay, good. That's fine. I'll just leave it without color. It's not that important to me. So I created a link and now, ooh, I can publish it. Thank you. So I'll go through this a little bit later. I, it's a bunch of videos. Ooh, I do see the word analytics. You know, I love analytics. I'm going to go ahead. Um, you can embed this. I know you can send it as a newsletter, you can export it, all of that. For now, I just wanna see how this works for me. And then later on, I will um, figure out how I wanna use it. I don't always use links the way um, the publisher intends us to use it. So I'll let you know how this goes, but um, let's actually go to the link and see how it looks. Ooh, nice. I'm definitely going to change that. Yay. I have to reorder a couple of things, but I really do like this. It's very simple. So if you're not following me on Instagram, go ahead and head over to Instagram.com slash socially Nina. And if you have not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe and watch some of these other videos on bit.ly and Google links, those are all in the same realm of kind of playing with these links and link shorteners and all of those kind of things. All right, ciao.